And you can see how the Swiss devil has multiple faces and how Switzerland is Satan's own playground of the homo knights Templars adoring the Swiss Baphomet in the biggest Templar commandery in the world, Octogon Switzerland. This is another Swiss nightmare story about a man who became a woman for the next 10 years by surgical ways and then again had this had hers at this time herself operated and harmonized into a man again. I found the article accidentally as I had nothing else to read. And it appeared on September 22nd, 2018 in the very same Bernese newspaper in which they completely demonized me being a dangerous psychopath because of my historical analysis about Switzerland, which you can find accumulated in my film The Swiss Beast, Home of the Devil, a beast with multiple faces, as you can see here. And you can see some filthy Swiss art, which is in fact no art, but an internal message of the Red House and the White House in the true Freemason chessboard configuration in the original colors of Pharaoh. And of course, the teddy bear represents our children being their perfect slaves in the New World Order feudal system, with the colors of our masters all over our children's faces and bodies as the artistic 666 mark of the beast, the Swiss beast, that is. Our children are no more than a number anymore, uniformed, all lined up with their heads turned the same way as an army of obedient slaves, the 500 million who may stay. It's just as the music industry showing all their uniform, not very musical garbage and all about giving satanic messages for the initiated, similar to Swiss art. And our beautiful music has no chance to make it on the radio. Just listen to the cold, traditional Swiss music to understand that these cold beings are not capable of warm, human or divine art. That very same newspaper has intensively contributed in a 20-year endless terror against a totally normal, healthy family. My family. While depicting this Frankenstein monster horror story as a modern fairy tale and how beautiful it is to understand what it really feels like to be a man and a woman as a completion of one's full human identity and humanist understanding as the summit of true humanism adding to the imperfection of the creation. Funny though. They had no compassion nor understanding for my family and the terror this newspaper and their homo prostitutes helped inflicting on my children and how my three-year-old daughter cried her soul out witnessing massive police brutalities four feet away from her on their four last arrests on July 16, 2015 and my 12-year-old son Another needless witness, still traumatized by it today, 2019, and so on, and so on. So folks, it is not at all about human compassion as this meticulous Swiss newspaper propaganda goes on. It's only about their agenda. Mr. Frankenstein here is a university professor, a lawyer, and a politician. So a fairly intelligent person. So he must be right doing it, eh? Because he's a professor in law. And a Freemason too, as all politicians are Masons, which is the law of the New World Order horizontal rule. It can't be otherwise. To complete Swissy's maleficent fairy tale, they write that this thing here is brave and a national hero, while I, Sean Ross, in the previous articles published on my channels Gyuri and Gatsefrat, should be locked up forever. 
which they actually wrote and published black and white. The Swiss beast hates immigrants who speak up, while it here, called Martin, became Catherine for ten years after. Well, you wouldn't call your daughter Catherine anymore after reading this, eh? The professor lawyer is rich and has loads of cash. But do you think he paid himself for this million dollar double gender bender? No, you paid for it because of massive tax evasion drain out, drain out of your country into the biggest Templar commandery in the world where entire cities and regions thrive because of your hard earned bucks with which entire schools and hospitals in Switzerland get funded through some letterbox company from your country in a Swiss low tax canton. And look how it, what it says here. It says a department for gender questions. It says they want a department for gender questions. You know, in the parliament, this newspaper wants that they're, they're gonna make it official. You see, Mr. Frankenstein. They call it here die doppelte Entscheidung, which is Satan laughing in our faces because Scheide in German is the medical term for vagina and Entscheidung, a cynical way of describing the removal of a vagina, which this thing literally did. It here had his phallus removed like a lumberjack cutting a tree with roots and all. Then had a big round hole full of scars and stitches sewn into. Hoping some hairs would grow over to conceal the trap hole. Like a lonely temper, Templar in a masculine Cistercian monastery dreaming of having his own personal pussy all the time and then after 10 bitch years reverse the nut job backwards again where the question remains did he get his own dick back? I understand and next to your tax evasion though for the bulk part I understand now why health insurance is compulsory in Switzerland. So normal healthy people who never see a doctor have to come up for these nut jobs by the homo mafia in Satan's own paradise called Switzerland. Swiss, I got you, you're a girly now. Not a fairy tale, but a filthy tale from Switzerland, where they hate normal people and natural things and where the Swiss love lies, deceit, murder, Satanism, transhumanism, financing of world wars, dictators, drug dealers, child molesters, everything evil. And the man himself has taught them. Go and have a Swiss in Switzerland, the ultimate way to finally understand a woman, your wife or mother-in-law, and really get into her skin. There you go for the ones who read German. This is the magazine inside the newspaper. It's probably on a Saturday. It says the man who became, who was a woman and who was a man. And here it says, die doppelte Entscheidung. There he is. Okay. Mr. Frankenstein. Here he is. It is what he became. Hello. You see? Department for Gender Questions. So they already make us used to it. It's coming, you see? So, if you read German, you can read it all here. It's, it's, I, I, I was so disgusted by reading this, really. Yeah, there you go. I do it slowly. Just punch pause. And this is, you know, this is social engineering. Okay? And how, how nice they write about him, you know, compared with me. You know, do it slowly. You can read the filth yourself. There you go. Next page. There you go. My card is empty. Or is it my bed? No, it's my card. There you go. It's 
absolute filth. That's where we're going to. You know, Switzerland was the first new world order in the world in 1291. And everything which comes in Switzerland, we will have it everywhere in the world. It's not first America. People always used to say this, you know, everything that comes that is in America, we will get it too after a couple of years. No. First Switzerland, then America, because the United States was the second new world order in the world. And then we get it all. So, I do it a bit quicker because I have no more batteries. And my SD card is getting empty, so you just punch pause, right? I'll make sure you got it all. And so we document it. So repent, Swissy. Your time will be up. Repent and do something against it. Stand up. I know. You've been all breeded out, all the good people, they all killed them in Switzerland over the years, as they did with me, or they tried, you know, or they killed some parts of me. But the, uh, the resistance part is still there, yeah. I stopped making music. I gave concerts. I showed you playing classical guitar and Spanish guitar on my other channel. They killed it inside. Something snapped. Right? But the resistance part is still there. Right? Oh, get, out, get out of my face now. There we are, Swissy, with your heroes and your department of gender question. I'll make it official. There's your department and your Swiss flag. Hey, right? There are your heroes with your filth stories. Bye-bye, Swissy. Your time will come. Your time is up. So, you know, these Swiss, the, uh, the white race is the most terrorist race in entire human history. We didn't take black slaves, it was the aristocracy, and all the ships belonged to the Swiss. And um, it was, so I'm sorry, my African brothers, we didn't do it. The uh, General Custer, he was Swiss. See my video on my channel, Gure or Hatzefrat, I don't remember. He was the squaw killer. The white people didn't do it, he was Swiss. The Nazi Templars, it's a cancer in the middle of Europe. Um, so even, uh, so I'm sorry my Indian brothers, even the Americans were tortured by, th in, in a, uh, by Swiss Captain Wirtz. They were murdered and tortured um, during the Civil War, Northerners. Uh, there were three concentration camps for American aviators in Switzerland. Le Diable Ré, Vauville Armos, and Hunneberg. So even Americans got tortured by them. The, um, so I'm sorry for things we didn't even do. So I'm sorry my Asian brothers, because uh, Donald Rumsfeld, they called him the tough Swiss, and he was shooting around there in his helicopter in Vietnam. It's all Pharaoh, the Swiss, and they did worse with the white people. They murdered our fathers, and they, they, our sons were raised by them, you know, and the women. And they put them in the army and changed their minds. We don't have any more gods. Our gods destroyed Rome once, so we need them back. We need our gods back. Because it doesn't work like this. I see what a mess it all is.